I've been working with Squarespace for about four years now, and I've honestly never had a request to add a calendar block into a page. And it was about three or four days ago, a client asked me, okay, we are a church and we want to have a calendar of events and we don't want to show it as an event in a, in a summary block. We want to show it as a calendar. And I was like, oh, get the, can you do this on Squarespace? I had a rough idea that maybe you could, but I wasn't sure how to implement it. So I went through, put a block in, added the events into the, into the calendar, and it actually looked really good. So I thought, again, as with most things that I talk about, it's quite niche, but you know, why not try and add that to your roster and show you how to do it? It's really simple. So I'm gonna take you on over to the screen and we'll go through it now. So the first thing that we wanna do is go into website and find the page that we want to add the calendar to. So I'm just going to add it to the home page, go into edit, and then we will add in our section. So I'll go down here, we'll add a section and we'll just add a blank for now. We'll click on add block, and then we want to just search for calendar. That's there. And then the calendar pre-populates like this. So I'm just going to resize it to the full width of the page. And then you can see that it gives some examples here. But at the moment, nothing is linked up. So I'm just gonna save so we can keep track of our progress. And then to actually add in something to the calendar, we double click and then you can see we have lots of different options that we can add on. So I have blogs on the website, we can add those in. We can add products and we can add events. So events is, is gonna be the main one. So I'm gonna click that and then I'm gonna hit save. And then once we've hit save, we can see what our calendar is looking like. Now, if I go through to where the events are, there we go. So I think they start in January. We're gonna see event one, and then all of the other events, so I think you can scroll down for when the other ones start, like this. So if you have multiple on at the same time, when you hover, you can actually scroll through them all like this. And this calendar is linked to the events page. So I'll show you where that is now. This is one I've created earlier. Now this is an events page and here are our events. So if you create a new event like this, we'll just call this example event and we'll add a date and a time of tomorrow from 9 a.m. to Friday at 5 p.m. Hit save, hit exit, and then I'm just gonna publish that now. So head into options, head into status, published, save then if i go back to our home page we can see our new event is scheduled so 9a just means 9 a.m and then you can see it fills up tuesday wednesday thursday and friday and it also gives the user the option to to click it so if they want to go onto the event landing page itself they can just either click this or when they hover they can click on the title and that will take them directly into the page now obviously I haven't populated it with anything, but you can add whatever you want in there. So that's how you add the calendar and that's how you link a collection such as event to it. If you found this useful, please make sure to leave a like, hit subscribe and check out all of the Squarespace resources in the description below.